Microsoft patents a system to play <laughs> discs on consoles with no disk drive. Luke, you want to do this one? It's so funny. Okay, yeah, I read that title, and my immediate knee jerk was like, what? That doesn't work. It's got to just be an external optical drive. How else is this going to happen? And then I start reading through it, and I'm like, okay, okay, there's actually some cool things in here, and I'll get to those in a moment. And I finally get to the, the bullet point that's like, the proposed system involves using an external disk drive to verify the Xbox game. It's like, yeah, of course. <laughs> Okay, anyways, so let's actually go properly through it, because it is somewhat interesting. Uh, over the past decade, we've seen physical media become less and less pre prevalent as more consumers have switched to digital purchases or streaming services. That is true. I have some problems with that. Whatever. Let's move on. Uh, to the point that both Microsoft and Sony sell a version of their current consoles with no disk drive, also known as, in this specific case, the Xbox Series S. Uh, if you decided to pick up an Xbox Series S, you'll find you have no way to play your Xbox One back catalog if you have them on digital or uh, uh, physical versions. Um, but in a recently discovered patent from 2020, it's not even new, uh, Microsoft proposes a system allowing players to receive digital versions of the games that they bought on disc. So that's what's going on. You're like verifying that your you have it, I guess. Effectively. Yeah. yeah. Um, it, it's unknown... Uh, I don't know if this goes into it in the notes, but it's, it's unknown if you like if the physical version will f keep working fully independently, right? Like, because I because if it did, you could sell that. Like, would it transfer the license to the digital version? Then, Can like, you transfer it back? <laughs> and then, like, how does it stop the physical version from working? Are you sure it's 2022? Because it sounds like 1984. It's weird. It's just like the amount, like, do we own anything anymore? I'm not, I'm not actually sure. I mean, that's, that's my continued argument for buying stuff like Switch games physically. And I know like a lot of people don't want to do it and that's fine. Do whatever you want. Well, if there's anyone who's going to you on it, it's going to be Nintendo. Yeah. Honestly though, like seriously, that's yeah. part of my argument. <laughs> They're really bad with like yeah. anything online. Thanks for watching, and thanks to Drop for sponsoring this week's clips. Top-selling Drop.com audio file and mechanical keyboard products are up to 30% off from now until May 30th. Check out the sale using the link below.